Please be seated. Hello, Your Honor. Hello. This is the case of Fedoyan versus Roland. Thank you, Jerome. Good day, everyone. Good day. Good day. Ms. Fedoyan, you are here to prove to your on again, off again boyfriend of 12 years that your three month old son, Ezekiel, is his biological child. You say the paternity denial is destroying your relationship, and you need today's results to repair the breakdown in your family. Is that correct? Yes. Mr. Rowland, you say Ms. Fendoyan was in a sexual relationship with another man weeks before you learned of her pregnancy, and you and your mother's best friend are here to prove her son Ezekiel is not your biological child. Is that correct? Yes, yes Your Honor. So, Ms. Fendoyan, you say your family is broken. Explain. He keeps denying my son, constantly denying him, his family is always putting a bug in his ear. That's not your child. He don't Honor, look that like that is him. not my child at all. Yo, well, you're gonna see? I know who I slept with. And I know my baby. Wow, if you was, you was with me, you was with somebody else at the same time. Like, I know who I lay in bed about? with, and I know the okay. days I okay. Thank okay. you very much. Okay, so okay. Miss Fendoyan, we go. we're gonna have to use uh, <laughs> court appropriate language. My all right. Is your honor? Yes. Court appropriate language. All right, well, we're all oh, awake man, now. Just... Um, <laughs> so, Ms. Fendoyan, tell the court the nature of your relationship with Mr. Rowland. Well, we, we go through a lot. We had our first child. Everything was good. It was perfect, you know? Things started getting nice. rocky. I came home from work one day, and this man That's says ridiculous. he's going to the store. Ridiculous. Go, going to the store, you know, you wouldn't think nothing of it. Your man going to the store. He goes to the store, that man go missing. Two days, where you at? I go to his family house and <laughs> what do I see? Opens the door with a chain of hickeys all over his neck. Mr. Roland, why did you have hickeys all on your neck? Because we weren't together. I no, was, I, I was able to do, do whatever that's I bull. feel like, uh, Your Honor. No, we were together. We were not together at all. We were all, together. At all. In her eyes, we yes, together. she thought it. We were not together. We were together. Not in mine. So did you say you were going to the store and never came back? Yes, I did. Yes, I did. I sure did. I had two girls. I didn't need her at the time. I don't... I had two. I was dating two girls at once. Come but that's on. why you kept that's running back, right? That's the best of both right? lives right there. That's why you kept running back, right? Yeah. All right, so we're, we're, we obviously see that Mr. Roland has moved on. He's got another woman. You're in this relationship. What happens next? What happens? At some point, you find out you're pregnant or I you get back together? What? I waited. I patiently waited for him to come back. I waited a month and a half. He ain't come back. I said, you know what? I'm gonna do me. How? How? If you went to Albany and picked up a whole new guy? Sure did. After a whole month and a half, you want to yeah, be okay. You was already dating somebody two, else. What two females around here? your arms making me look stupid in the streets. And? Are you... You are out of your and? mind. You are out of your mind. Yeah, okay. So, I... Damn sure did. I went to Albany and I picked up a friend that became more than a friend. That actually this son you couldn't do. Yeah. So you admit you start having sex with this of new guy? Yes. All right, so then what happens? So we start sleeping around and he kept calling, calling. crying. I, pff, don't and go there. We met in junior high school. She was like a tail to me. I would have a girlfriend, she would just be right behind me, still wanted to mess with me, still want to do everything with me. Okay, but See, what I don't understand... All these years, she's just been a tail But Okay, but listen, whatever you say, the bottom <laughs> line is, is you had moved on, mm -hmm. she had moved on. So how in the world do we get to this position where we're here in paternity court? Obviously, you all got back together for something. Yeah. <laughs> he kept coming back, Your Honor. He kept coming back like a tail. No. <laughs> you kept, kept calling me. Back, She's crazy. And I just kept taking him She's in. You know, crazy. we already have one kid together. Why not? So I'm gonna sleep with you. Me and she was boy, sleeping we, we at were, the same time with we, someone right, else. First of all, yes, I went back and forth. Yes, I did. Hey, so how are you gonna try to pin this child on me? Because Personal, like, I know what that is not my child. That is not my child, Maya. Come on, go somewhere with that. This child looks him. like Call you. The that. child does not look like the other man. But we weren't together, though. How, we were honor, together. We were not together. We were together. And I was using condoms with her. So I don't understand how is that even possible that it's... So you don't believe the condoms break? <laughs> that, not that time. Okay. So how often were you all being intimate at that time? <laughs> nah. 
Here and there. Here and there? Here and there, nothing okay. serious. You mean how many times she was intimate with the other guy? I mean, and how many times? times? They said, he says they were broken up, but then they say they're still intimate. I'm just trying to figure out what is going we were on. Broken up. I'm sorry, Your Honor. We were broken up, but we was back and forth. Okay. Ms. Ms. Matos, what, what do you know about this? Can you tell the court? Well, what do you know? When I first met Tanya, there was like a couple of guys lined up in front of her door, kicking her door, wanting to get with her and that. And, um, you know, to put it like this, Tanya has more traffic than the Statue of Liberty in her home. <laughs> Um, right there. I, I, this is my proof I right just, here. I'm totally confused about all this because, you know, she told me she was pregnant in April and then, like, two or three weeks later, she knew it. And in May, she's pregnant again. I'm like, but how could that be? It's impossible that you have a baby, you're pregnant one month, and then the following... You lose it that month, and the following month, you're pregnant again. So this is what kind of throws me off about this... So you believe the whole story sounds a little off. It doesn't yeah, add up. I, I actually think it's the, it's the other guy's baby, and she tried to say she lose it, then come out pregnant <laughs> again to make it seem like it's daddy's baby. Oh, to shift the window right, of conception right, and the right, timeline. Right, right. If you want more episodes of Paternity Court, make sure to subscribe and click on the notification bell. So, are you doing some timeline manipulation, Ms. Vendoyan? That's exactly what yeah, it is, okay. Your Honor. I That's wish. exactly what it is. Because the other guy's not around, so she needs somebody to be there for... Just a child that's not mine. And he would be a thing. perfect father, better than you. Yeah, okay. So, yeah. Ms. Fendoyan, take me you're to the pregnancy. Out. Take me to the point you realize you're pregnant. I actually ran to my best friend's house. Okay, they see, look. And I, I ran in there, and I'm like, girl, the first thing that came out, I was like, girl, you, listen. I'm pregnant. Yeah. She's like, you're lying. I'm like, no, I'm serious. Look. She's like, girl, whose is it? I'm like, honestly, I don't know. Okay, then you see, look, right there. At the time, it right I didn't there. know. That At the time, I it. didn't know. All right, well, wait, let her tell it. If she's gonna tell the truth, the then let her I tell it. I'm not telling no truth. <laughs> so she said at the time she didn't know. All right. I went to the, I went to the doctor's office later on that week, and, you know, they gave me they gave me my conception date. They gave me my due date. And it falls on to the days that we were messing around. How if you say you were still messing with him on the seventh, but then you messing with me on the eighth and you found out you're yep. pregnant. So how All is right. it? Yep. how is this? He left on the so seventh. So Miss Fendoy yeah. gave him some. Okay then. So there you go. There you go. And it. So Miss Fendoyan, you submitted a calendar to the court which outlines the window of time you were having sex with Mr. Rowland again. You say you started to have sex with him again on May 8th. If we go to the next page, you also indicated you were having sex with the other man where it's outlined in red, May 1st through May 7th. Come on, Yana. If we so go right to the there. window so right of conception... <laughs> Ezekiel's birth date is... January 30th. January 30th of what year? 2019. 2019. We press calculate. The window of conception would be May 5th to May exactly. 13th. See? Exactly. Let's go back to the calendar. Come on. If we look at May right 5th there. Come on. through May 13th, Come on, Your Honor. That is not my child. You can tell it. It overlaps. You split right through the middle. That's why I think she never lost it the first time. She never listen, lost listen, it. She bro, never lost it. Listen, listen, bro. Who claimed that she ain't got a job? You stay in my business. never lost, lost, it. Never lost, never lost it. The baby resembles him all oh, the way. Tanya, the baby... Come on, come on. Be Does honest with her. Come, come on. on Be honest the with yourself. The baby resembles you. Be honest with yourself. It proves it right there. Right. So you telling me he don't look like you? Nope. Not at all. And if I'm wrong... I apologize. Okay. It is what it is. We, gonna, I want to know the truth. You're going to be apologizing real soon. All right. I guarantee it. You kind of got a little resemblance of both. I mean, so Come it could on. be... So Come what on. you telling me? Come like on. a little resemblance Wait. of the other... Wait. Wait a minute. You know who the other guy is? Yeah, I see. I, she have them both in the house Your at the same she time. She was in my house every day in that boy's face. She would Come put on. every day in my house. You got the same as the other guy. Collecting Here's information. This one on. This one was going to... Every day, she did not let me Come on. Your Honor, she was this one will go to sleep and she'll go upstairs and entertain the other one. Yes. In the I same house. I in the hallway, her door will be open and she'll yes. be upstairs. Yes. In the house. same house, wait for me to go to sleep to have them over. Or whoever else no, over. No, they both be awake. 
and then one go to sleep, he'll go to sleep, and she'll be upstairs playing with the other one. What? Huh? Uh, in the we same house, together. so why didn't it matter? And they both sleep in the same house. All three sleep in the same house. We wasn't together. You was, he was sleeping. Uh, Yana, they were separate. Come on, come on. Was she she was go we wasn't together. And she would go upstairs while I'm downstairs in the same house and we still messing with together. him. We wasn't together. We wasn't together. Excuse my language. You weren't together, but you no. were living together? <laughs> yeah. He's a bum. He has no place to go. But you need me, though. But you want me to be the father, though, right? Get out of here. You I know. Let's get it straight. I would very you much appreciate the, the, the fact that you respect me. Bah, bah, and one time bah. I had to man him up, Your Honor, and tell him, you know, why well, you better man up? You're not leaving this house and let the next man lay in your bed. Let Are me you say kidding something. me? No, let me tell you something, Your Honor. Uh, yep, yeah. totally. She totally did. Yeah, Your Honor. Honor. Make a man up. I'm like. giving birth, and this man is on the phone with his mother. Come on, let's be for real. About, oh the baby God. came out. It wasn't even 60 seconds. They, they plopped the baby on my chest. This is him. Uh, the, the baby kind of looks like nope. our other daughter. No, I told you specifically it looks nothing like me. So she says, the ba he said the baby kind of looks like... His mother going to ask him what the baby looked like. You can hear her? Yes. Screaming through the phone. And my mother even told me not to sign a birth certificate because it didn't look yes, like me. Yes, she... No. Yes, she was a yes, she She also submitted a statement to the court. Her statement reads... Tanya is obsessed with my son, and she is only telling him this is his son to keep him around. I am sure she is telling 10 different men they are the father, too, because that's the type of girl she is. I know Tanya gets around, and that is not news to anybody. When the tests come back that my son is not the father, I hope he moves on. That lady need to mind her business, Your Honor. That lady uh, didn't have uh, a life since we were kids. She never liked uh, me. She never liked me at all. She wanted him to be with whoever she sets him up with. She never liked me for nothing. Only people like she you only... only people that's messing with you. Yeah, like you, that. right? I ain't messing I know, with you like no you. more. Yeah. I don't mess with you anymore. You'll be back. You'll be back. You always come she back. She even You're got pictures of her. Like she got pictures of her. And you come. She even got pictures of her on, on social media laying next to another guy and having the baby in the middle of it. Right between them. And so, she's the same wait a minute. Day, he got no shirt on. There you go. Right there. And she's right on the other side. And you believe this guy is the father? Who knows? Who knows? <laughs> Who knows? If you was more around and you was to take care of your child, there wouldn't be no other man. Right. But you wouldn't I'm run around. Good. So you think you're going to do not your... Miss Fedorian, I, I do I have around. to ask you, is this the other man? Yes. Oh! So this is the other potential father. Yes, this is the man that I have went and picked up, like he says. Does he believe he's Ezekiel's biological father? He tells me no. He says that Nobody my son is a split image father. of him. They both spoke on it. They oh, both sat in the same house on the same couch and spoke on it. They both sat there. You lolly gag. Okay. Listen, let me tell you uh, something. You don't relax yourself. All right, blah, relax blah, blah, blah. You're blah. so full of it. You're full of it. Well, all you doing is this. All right. That's it. That's it. But I mean, so when, when you look... home, I'm going to do this. But when you look at the picture, I mean, it looks like a little baby looking at his dad. Mm-hmm. And I mean, yes. <laughs> that's what it looks like. <laughs> so, and this man says that he knows he could be the father, but he doesn't think he is. Correct, Your Honor. But... In your mind, you truly believe Mr. Roland is? Yes. Yes, Your Honor. Just based on the way the baby looks? Yes, Your Honor. Oh, okay. My son, Your Honor, resembles a lot of my daughter. A lot. He resembles... Well, they do have the same mother. <laughs> but you're saying because you believe they have the same father, too. Come on. Yes. You make yourself sound crazy right now. Only one sounding crazy is you. Okay. Keep denying my child. It's not my child. Like, how many times do I got to keep saying it? Whatever. Uh, right, whatever. We're going to find out soon enough. Hold on. So we're going to find out right now. Yeah. Thank you. <laughs> because I have the results. Yes, Your own... Your honor. Let's get it. Let's get it. <laughs> These results were prepared by DNA Diagnostics, and they read as follows. In the case of 
Stephen Doyen versus Roland. When it comes to three month old, Ezekiel Fendoyan. It has been determined by this court. Mr. Roland, you are the father. Step up to the plate. That's there what I can do. Again, I did. <laughs> Nothing more I can do now. You all have developed a very contentious relationship. It is just a, I mean, Aww. part of it's entertaining because you have so <laughs> much personality and charisma, both of you. But the truth is, the baby don't need no show. The baby needs you to show up. Right. right? Right? Let's protect the children, and I want you to get some help right now, okay? I wish you all the very best. Court is adjourned. <laughs>